Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Jesse, and this is the rocky coast of Maine. So today we are going to be catching fish at the very bottom of this 200 foot cliff. It's about halfway there. Let's get down there. So we got the tricky part done, and today we are going to be using the fly rod to go and try to catch some harbor pollock. And you're going to find them underneath the cliffs, anywhere where there's a lot of structure and weeds for them to hide in. That's generally where you're going to find them. Today we're going to be using an eight weight fly rod just in case we have a striper go by. What I'm going to be fishing is I have a floating line and that is attached to a seven foot sinking tip. So this is a T8, which means it's going to sink about six to eight inches per second which is gonna be just enough to get me in the range that we need to be to catch these fish. Today we're gonna to be using some tungsten jigs that I tied up this morning. And of course, as with all the flies on this channel, if you guys wanna use some yourself, you can just send me an email and I'd be happy to tie some up for you. And we're gonna start with this chartreuse jig, probably my favorite to use in the ocean. Pretty much you saw that box, I stock it with pink and chartreuse. If those two can't catch me a fish, then uh, We've got other problems. <laughs> no need to overcomplicate things. So we are gonna start off right here. I think this is gonna be a safe enough spot. So you can see what I wanna fish. This entire edge, you know, we have this cliff. It doesn't just stop here. This goes way, way down. There's also a lot of weeds that build up off this rock. So we're gonna cast about five feet off of there and jig this back. And hopefully there's gonna be plenty of eager pollock there to, to bite. Oh. Whoa. Boy, tough bite, man. While we're waiting on some fish, I have an announcement for the channel. I just created a brand new website for you guys to check out. You can go to www.mainly-outdoors.com. You're gonna find a bunch of new shirts with our brand new logo, some stickers, coffee mugs. In addition to that, I created a brand new streamlined custom fly order forms. So if you want custom flies from me, now you can just go to the website, submit all the information that I'll need. Go check it out. Let me know what you think. And if there's any issues with the site, please let me know. It is a work in progress, but I put a ton of time into this and I'm pretty happy with how it turned out. So I've been fishing for quite a while now. And unfortunately I haven't got anything and it's it's really hard just to get down to the point where I can actually fish because most of it, the water line starts right here and then that drops off significantly to the water. And I'm finding that I can't find a lot of spots to actually get down there and fish it well. The reason for that is because I decided to come out here at low tide. I couldn't make high tide, so I thought oh, I'll come out and try to make a video anyway. I'm not gonna give up though. I'm gonna keep trying see if I can't catch one. There's a little one. A lot of these little ones have been chasing my hook, but they're all about six inches long, so that's not exactly what I'm looking for. There we go. This one's not huge, but it's, it's a decent size, enough to get part of a meal anyway. Might have to catch a few more. Yeah, he's not bad. For the ones I've been seeing, this isn't too bad at all. So I'm gonna keep that for sure. Gonna knock this guy out. That's one fish anyway. We're gonna need a few more of those to make a nice dinner though. So we're gonna keep at it. Of course, I gotta leave before uh, this guy warms up too much. So we managed to get that one and I gotta say it's pretty difficult right now. Anyway, we're gonna keep at it. 
See if we can't get, uh, let's say two more. If I can get two more, I'll do a catch and cook. Just need a couple more fish and uh, that's enough for a catch and cook. It is a nice day. It seems like it should be raining, but it's not predicted in the forecast. Tomorrow we have a, uh, the tail end of a hurricane, I guess, coming through. That's why I came out today. I figured might as well get in some, uh, well, not necessarily, I'll probably fish when it's raining, but we won't be filming. So I figured I'd come out and do a little filming. For all this rain comes and I can't do it. Okay, next. Jeez, that was lucky. I had just enough time. Luckily, I'm not in a spot I can get swept out. That's why I'm kind of getting a little closer, a little more risky spot here. This is shallow and pretty sheltered. Sometimes it's important to show that fishing doesn't exactly always go as planned and you don't always catch that many. Even if you know the right spots, I've been here plenty of times and caught plenty of fish, but Today, it just didn't work out. If you wanna help support the channel, I just made a brand new website. I'm gonna link that down below and I am very excited about it. We got a brand new logo and there's all kinds of cool stuff to come. So if you guys do go check out the website and decide to help support me, I appreciate it. And I promise you that I will be making better videos than I made today. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I will catch you in the next venture. You have a good night. Wow. <laughs> Oh, I almost smashed that GoPro.